Welcome to another Photoshop tutorial from TutorVid.com. This tutorial is showing you what's new in Photoshop CS6 and how to use it. This tutorial is going to go over the Content Aware Patch Tool. And the patch tool was introduced in CS5 and you find it over here with the J key. And if you hold and click, there's a bunch of different options here. And we'll click the middle one here, Patch Tool. And looking at the settings up here, to use the Content Aware Patch Tool, you have to click down here and then click Content Aware. But first I'll show you what the normal patch tool does. I've made my selection here, just a loose selection around the girl. And if I wanted to replace her, and just with some regular background, the regular patch tool just tries and takes what's over here and uh, mixes it with what was here a little bit. And this is what you get. It's sort of a blue from her shirt and not super well, it worked really good for some things, but the content aware in something like this would work quite a bit better. So if you just put it on content aware and slide it over, we can see what Photoshop can come up with. And you can see that's quite a bit better. It didn't take any of the blue. And so content aware essentially gives Photoshop license to make up pixels and figure out what would be best under here. And it's not perfect. There's a few spots down here you'd have to fix up with the clone tool. But it seemed a lot of work and it seems to work quite a bit better. Another new feature with these tools is the sample all layers, which uh, is very handy because you can, if we had created a new layer first, and on this layer you can see is blank. And now if we do that content aware fill on with the blank layer selected, now it's just this area that's on this layer. And so this way you can keep your editing cleanly on another layer and your original image on a base layer. And that's it. Check out more CS6 tutorials on tutorvid.com. <laughs>